Hi, Alice. It's Miss Chen here. Um, we miss you. I hope you're doing well. I hope Sophia's doing well. Um, anyway, I've been anxious to catch up with you, but I thought maybe I could just read you a special story just for you. Um, and I know you like this one because you would listen to it a lot in the classroom. Alice the Fairy by David Shannon. My name is Alice. I'm a fairy. I'm not a permanent fairy. I'm a temporary fairy. You have to pass a lot of tests to be a permanent fairy. I have wings so I can fly. I can't fly very high yet, but I can fly really fast. This is my magic wand. This is my blanket. Fairies use magic wands to change frogs into princesses, princes and things like that. I changed my dad into a horse. One time my mom made cookies for my dad, so I turned them into mine. I felt bad about the cookies, so I thought I'd whip up a new outfit for my dad. Did I tell you he's the Duke of Morningside Drive? Well, he is. Golden sparkly pants, purplish pinkish shoes, my favorite color. But clothes were too hard, so I made him a new crown instead. With my magic wand, I can make leaves fall from trees and I can draw pictures on water. Wow. Sometimes I use my wand to disappear, but that's kind of scary. I'd rather use my blanket. Of course, I also have magic mirrors. Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fairest of them all? Well, what do you know? It's me, Alice. Thank you, mirror. Fairy dust is very useful. I turn it, I use it to turn my oatmeal into cake. What do you think that fairy dust is, Alice? Maybe sugar? Casting spells is another important part of being a fairy. Watch me make my dog float on the ceiling. Hocus, pocus, crocus, docus, Hauken, token, riggin, flauken, doggin, floggin, biddle, noggin. Okay, that one needs a little work. But a fairy must be very careful with magic. Once I accidentally turned my white dress into a red one. That made the Duchess so mad she locked me in the tower forever. I got away though. A fairy's life is filled with danger. Broccoli is often poisoned by the wicked duchess and should never be eaten. Fairies also hate baths. I'd like to turn my bath water into strawberry jello. That would be fun, but I don't know how yet. You have to be a permanent fairy to do tricks like that. They go to advanced fairy school to learn how. Look at all those flying fairies. I'm supposed to learn how to make clothes get up off the floor and dance around in a lot and line up in my closet. I wish my clothes would do that. I'm not very good at that though. be a temporary fairy forever. She's still working on changing that frog into a prince. Well, Alice, I hope you enjoyed your story. I hope you're doing well. Um, I can't wait to see you sometime soon. All right, take care. Hi to your family.